Hi, it's Mind Crypto here. I hope we're having a wonderful morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are in the world. Remember, this isn't financial advice. Always do your own research. Mind Crypto here. I hope we're all having a wonderful day. And today we're talking about Alliance Block NXRA. Leading DeFi regulations is what we're talking about. But first and foremost, let's look at these crypto bubbles. We're looking a bit greener. XDC is absolutely flying. As we can see, um, everything else is slightly green and a little bit of red, a bit of a mix, a bit of a balance. And as we can see, Alliance Block up five ranks to 362 and currently at 0 0.05 cents and market cap of 41 million and a 24 hour volume of 201,000, 0.1% in the day, down 5.7 in the week and down 18.2% in the month. God, blimey, some people taking some profit there. So um, lots going on with regards to NXRA. And I see this from Bull Shark Trading, NXRA, Alliance Block. Some trade analysis, triple bottom. We are bullish on long term for NXRA, especially after launching its own exchange, which we're going to talk about in a moment. Last bull run, the exchange tokens done well. Looking for a continuation to the downside with lower lows and lower highs with a possible run on the sell side liquidity. Confirmed triple bottom could see price make a 155% gain onto the all-time high. Obviously, this could go lower, but with what the team are building, we are bullish for the macro. And it's absolutely, I mean, you know, there's lots going on at the moment. It's dipped and it's gone. We can see this trend sideways, which a lot of the coins are doing at the moment, along with coins like Quant, which you know I absolutely love. But I stick in there. This is time for DCAing. Remember, none of this is financial advice. Always do your own research, as I'm not a financial advisor. I, mean, I see this tweet from Miles Deutscher. Um, the US just introduced a tax proposal that could kill DeFi as we know it. The US Treasury and IRS just released proposed cryptocurrency regulations that may deem DeFi applications like Uniswap, OneInch, Curve, Metamask, etc. to be brokers and forced to implement KYC. And it says here the proposed rules would apply to other digital assets such as non-fungible tokens as they would apply the so-called decentralized finance platforms which use software to link crypto buyers and sellers directly rather than routing their orders through a company such as coinbase or anyone else now i see this brilliant tweet reply next era id and now they say here in response to the us tax proposal on DeFi, next era id stands ready with our privacy preserving compliance protocols and applications can adopt kyc seamlessly while empowering user control next era id is the key to balancing compliance with the decentralized core principles now that is absolutely brilliant now we know that alliance block are working stupidly hard and trying to bring this technology together and they've just brought it out recently so they are already ahead of the game so all already foreseeing some of the implications that will come out in the future. So we also see this from Coindesk, US crypto tax proposal lets miners off the hook, snares some decentralized exchanges. The IRS is finally proposing rules for crypto tax reporting, giving the industry its own 1099 form and declaring digital asset miners safe from the future requirements. And as we can see here, crypto exchanges, some hosted wallet providers and payment processors will face new tax rules in as soon as two years. The proposal, which is opening to a comment period and public hearings, would exempt miners and certain other types of activities. The US Treasury Department has finally unveiled its definition of a broker for the crypto industry, defining how crypto companies and investors will need to meet tax reporting obligations and are answering a years old question over whether decentralized finance platforms and miners will need to gather their users personal data the treasury department published a nearly 300 page proposed rule on friday in response to the 2021 infrastructure investments and job act saying centralized crypto exchanges payment processes and some hosted wallet providers some decentralized exchanges and people or entities that redeem crypto tokens they created will be down to those reporting obligations. Moreover, Treasury unveiled a new custom tax form, the 1099DA, that these brokers can file, resolving long-standing confusion over whether a different version of the US tax form make the most sense for taxpayers. But 
Miners are exempt from tax rules, but some decentralized finance platforms will not be, said the proposed guidelines. Now, this is massive, actually, in, in the US. Um, I think the US is doing its damnedest to try and get people out of this market um, for whatever reason. We need rules and regulations in this. It is what it is. And we see this from Yahoo with regards to the Alliance Blocks debut of the Next Era Exchange that I was talking about, the on chain limit order book protocol on Arbitrum One. Um, Alliance Block today unveiled Next Era's Exchange, an innovative new decentralized exchange platform incorporating an advanced on chain order book protocol to provide deeper and more accessible liquidity across a diverse range of cryptocurrencies and tokenized assets. Next Era Exchange builds on the last year's launch of Alliance Block's DEX, which harnesses the power of cutting edge automated market maker to minimize the risk of impermanent loss for liquidity providers designed to meet the demand for more streamlined user interface and optimized liquidity mechanisms next era exchange acts as an intermediary layer making alliance blocks dex more efficient and user friendly dex platforms have a vast potential but struggle with challenges around the user experience and operational fluidity in contrast to the highly efficient experience centralized exchanges by leveraging an innovative on-chain order book protocol Nexera exchange bridges this gap providing a decentralized trading platform experience that rivals the very best CEX platforms while amplifying the core strengths of Alliance Blocks DEX. Now, as we know, they are following compliance and regulations, which make this an absolute must in the future with all the regulation that's coming, coming out, especially in Europe and in the US. Anyway, that was just a quick bit of news. To keep you updated on Alliance Block Next Era, please subscribe, please hit that notification bell so that you don't miss any further videos. All the best, and I'll catch you later. Remember, this isn't financial advice. Always do your own research.